In a previous video, we looked at how to use the free web tool Zotero Bib to create references, citations, and bibliographies by entering titles, ISBNs, links, and other identifiers to search for. Rather than having Zotero search for particular resources, we can also enter the details manually if we have them. To do this, we go to zbib.org, which is Zotero Bib, and we click on Manual Entry and enter the key pieces of information. So here's the fields into which we can enter the information. And we can see the first one is where we indicate what type of item or resource uh, we're dealing with. And if I click here, we can see the full list in the drop down list. Uh, and we can see from artwork, books, blog posts, computer programs, conference papers, and so on, journal articles. So in this case, I'm going to enter the details for a book. And now I'll enter the title of the book. And now the author's names. And in this case, there are three authors. So I'm going to fill in the first one, who is Peter Brown. So we have a field here for the last name and now the first name. And it's Peter C is the author's name. And then to add another author, I simply click on plus here. And now I have fields for the next author, whose name is Roe Digger. And his first name is Henry L. And there's one more author, and that's Mark McDaniel. And then some of the fields may not be necessary to fill in or may not be uh, applicable in this case. So the, the place where the book was published was in Cambridge, Massachusetts. The publisher was Harvard University Press. The date was 2014 and that should probably be enough. Uh, we can enter other information if we have it, but that should be enough for us to create the, the reference and then just scroll up and click on done. And it should be now in our bibliography. And again, for journal papers or any other resources, we can use the exact same principle. So we can do this instead of searching uh, with these identifiers, we can just simply add the entries manually.